Hey, what's going on guys? Simers here. Back at it again. Season 3. Catch you guys up on where we're at here. Sitting in second. That man of that Freiburg man, that just, just doesn't lose, does he? <laughs> 18 games in, he's won 16, he's drawn twice. So, <clears> hmm. <throat> Uh, eight points behind him. Five points clear of third. Uh, so far, so good. Obviously, we'd love to close that gap somehow, some way. So we'll see how that goes. Let's look at the schedule coming up. Uh, we had a little, I guess you would say, rocky uh, uh, time uh, a couple streams ago with two losses back-to-back -back in the league. That certainly didn't help right there. Uh, pretty much the uh, gap right there, uh, losing those two games. Hmm. for the most part but uh, we followed up with two wins and hopefully we can keep that streak going of course we do have Freiburg uh, coming up soon uh, but we've got to get through the, the January transfer window we're January 15th so we've got two games today uh, but we have the close of the window so I'm guessing that's probably as far as we get to we'll probably get to close the window today and then uh, on our next stream we'll kick off playing Freiburg so that'll be a huge Speaking of the window, I yeah, I don't know. I've been I've been sitting here just kind of loading up the save and we have two offers in. One is for uh Miguel Gutierrez, a left back from Real Madrid. Um he's young, but I say that he's 22. The guy that has really nice uh distribution of attributes, his mentals are a little low, uh, but his decisions are 14. So really it's his anticipation, bravery, composure, and concentration that, that are low. This is this is definitely lower than what you'd want for like a starter level. And I think that's why he's rated uh, much lower. Also his defense, defense isn't great. It's just okay. Um, but we do like his offensive uh, ability and his physicals are nice. And he does have potential. I think it's just a matter of he just needs game time. He hasn't had the game time to really develop at a uh, top top level or higher level. I think this is a buy that just makes sense as far as uh, for the value. And uh, if we can, uh, worst case, we loan him. I think our plan is going to be to loan him. And then either he, he develops like crazy and he potentially works into the team. Or we simply uh, sell him for value. And so I think this is a this is kind of a no-brainer buy if we have a couple million left over or laying around. And I say that we really don't have that many million laying around. We only have five million in the uh, the balance for this window. Um, and then the second item is Cal George from Juventus. And I'm going back and forth on this one. He's not definitely not a finished product. I think he suffers similar to. Uh, the left back there and that he just really hasn't played at a top level and he hasn't played well when he's you mean even playing in Serie B um so he's a guy that's close he needs to be better uh better offensively his physicals are slightly lacking uh but overall he's got a decent distribution of attributes and for the price, which is basically uh, we're doing a 1.5 up front and then I think 5.5 over like three years or something. I mean, I think that makes sense for this guy. The, the thing is, is like, do we want to just, is this money we just want to spend or do you want to like save this money for the summer window where we really need to, to, to uh, look to strengthen? Of course, the one player we're going to have to replace is Armando Broja who unfortunately is on loan right now. And I just don't anticipate we'll be able to loan him uh, again or essentially a third year. I just don't see us being able to do that because um, I think Chelsea is probably going to look at him kind of being around the Chelsea team. And then obviously we can't afford him. We have a, yeah, technically we have an optional future fee of 91 we're not spending 90 we don't have 91 million dollars even if we did uh we're not spending it on him uh even though he is extremely interested in joining the club blah 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 
Uh, we just can't afford him. And his contract at Chelsea is not over until 2027. So uh, that's kind of a note. So ultimately, we have to plan on how we're going to be, you know, how are we strengthening in the top here? I mean, I think we'd love to move, um, you know, a guy or two on, but we just haven't had the deals come in. And uh, one of those being our, our, our Luca Pellegrini. We definitely want to move him on at some point. Uh, attributes wise, he's great. I just think he, uh, unfortunately he just gets too many yellows and, uh, he's not reliable as far as staying on the field. So and it's not like he's been great anyways, when he's been on the field, so he's somebody we want to sell and, and we'd like to be in that 35 to 40 million range, uh, and also get his salary out. He's got one of the higher salaries. This doesn't do it justice here. Um, as far as like his base salary, you actually look at salary commitments, which is what I'd recommend uh, when you're doing kind of a deeper dive into like how much you're actually paying somebody. This takes into account, um, you know, like loyalty bonus and just things that are not just their base salary. Um, and so for him, he's got, you know, big time loyalty bonus. His appearance fee is pretty high. So he has just some other things that, that he gets as far as bonuses are concerned that actually increases salary quite a bit. And I think the other player we would love to move if possible ever is uh, Luka Sucic. Well, I think he's a really good player and, uh, you know, he's been producing. I just think I, I'm overloaded kind of on that attacking midfield uh, position. I mean, not only do I have Diamande, who can also play in the wing, but We've got our starter, which is Al Almada, right? So Almada is definitely our starting attacking midfielder. But then you also add in guys like, um, hmm, uh, where's he at? Oh, Vega, who I've I've slotted in in center midfield, but he's really not a a really ideal center mid. He's more of an attacking mid uh, from a just from a defensive standpoint. He doesn't do great in center mid and I, and I don't think he's explosive enough to really be on the wings uh so you add him in you add almada in you add diamante before you know it suchic is kind of like what we'd really like to do is move suchic and then invest in another midfielder or maybe a you know really good third center back or maybe we get that elite left left backs you know so there's there's just things we want to do it's it's we need to strengthen the attack we would love to add another uh, midfielder, and then we would love to uh, uh, improve our left back situation as well. So we definitely have the areas on the team that um, you know I think are preventing us from really taking that that next step and and making sure we lock down the lead next year. That's that's the goal, anyways. And so I think uh, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to think about this. Um, this cow George it's 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 definitely something I'd be able to sell him for value but then we're talking we're talking a year or two from now so that's just kind of what's weighing through my head right now um and it's not that much money I think I'll probably go for it but it's also the salary that we're also going to be offering him which is like 40,000 a week unfortunately it's about the lowest I could give him which puts slots him kind of middle of the pack um, as far as salary is concerned, kind of a big salary to, to then think about sending that guy out on loan. And we also have to take into account that uh, we're going to have probably Justin Deal come in and, and potentially be a rotation player next year. Um, that's kind of to be determined. Uh, he ideally really needs probably one more year on loan, uh, at least. So it's just kind of something else to kind of keep in mind as well. Let's uh, sit back and uh, let's jump in the chat and see if we can uh, get this thing rocking and rolling. Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, you guys want me to press continue? And I can't hear anybody. So let's figure out what's going on with my audio.
Chance that you can hear me, we can hear you. I can hear you now. Okay. <laughs> Actually, one. Huh. I, I, apparently, I have the same problem as Sky sometimes, where like, uh, Discord just doesn't recognize my input device, doesn't recognize my output device, and it's all over the. Yeah, it's a Discord not. thing. It's tough. That's tough. So, do we? Oh, Jesus! You guys blew me up. <clears throat> <laughs> my god <laughs> I was hoping there would be a third oh spicy did also do it oh Harry did it too yeah oh my god yeah, Wait, Harry I DM Simers and I gave him the reason <laughs> <laughs> nice <laughs> jeez do we, we don't have anybody you guys just want to like the whole scouting bug glitch thing it's, a, it's annoying that you have to shortlist everyone and you're not sure if you actually want them or not, but they yeah. seem to be fruitless for a while. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna sell a bunch of players. Oh? Says the man that needs a death. I sold two players already today. Left the club. I am looking to sell them. Uh, did, you, um, did you make money off of them, even though they're going for free? Yeah, I didn't sell nothing. Yeah, I like that, especially if you don't need the player. I lost like. Oh, you like, you lost Scarpa. I lost Scarpa. I bought him season one. I thought he was gonna be like my sneaky ace signing, and he was just never good for me. Yeah. And Forster was only around because he was homegrown. But next time in Europe, I'll have Sesco. I'm grown, so I don't need him anymore. Aw, Sesco. Yeah, five or ten years. Yeah, Sesco will be homegrown. Sesco's by homegrown now. next year. <laughs> oh, you said next time you're in Europe, so. Yeah, uh, next year. <laughs> next year, smile. He's still, he's still in it. I'm very much still in the race. It's just, I'm, I'm down right now. Dor Dorgan Dude, and Bayer are picking up steam again. That's because they haven't yeah, played one of us in a while. Mine's just losing speed, and I can catch Hoffenheim, and I can just get that seventh place place, hopefully. You're also You're no from... longer in Europe, which helps. Yeah. I don't. Yeah, I guess I am gonna lose. Yeah, you're right. No, no you, but I'm gonna. You, you are slowing play. down. At the beginning of the season, you were unstoppable. I fuck you all up again, like last time. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win the Europa League. So. Oh, to be fair, no. I need to win the Europa you League. Need to. At this point, I need to win the Europa League. Otherwise, I think like my team is just not gonna go anywhere. Because it's like, all of you guys know what you're doing, and, you know, we're all eating each other. So, yeah. I'm winning the Europa League, and uh, hopefully that fucks you over, Harry. So, there you go. That's what, my story. What we is... can both make Europe. We don't have to fight over it. <laughs> no, like... no, like, Just knock out Bayern and Dortmund. Like, why did it to you last time in the Pokal? Yeah, I know, it? but that was uncommon, because... Like, the exact circumstances had to happen for that to happen, and it did. And now you're like, oh, I'm going to beat Oxide. No, I just said you're losing games recently. If I can pick it up, I can catch you. You can overtake me. You can overtake mines. Like... I'd like to. <laughs> yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. Why is my club? We've lost 92 million this year. Why are we hemorrhaging money? Yeah, Last we're the... You need to make your bus you know. this year. Oh, so, yeah, that's probably it. Yeah, but you also have a shit ton of money, right, Harry? I'm only at 50 million left in the bank. Only. It's only. Yeah. We all I have like 20 at most. Probably. I haven't touched 50 mil. Oh, wait, never mind. Not Freiburg. But that's Freiburg. I have 50 mil in the bank. I know, I, I see that. 15 million <laughs> on transfers this month. Who did I buy? I mean, you could be blocked by. He has negative 22 million. Harry, isn't it installments? Huh? I've spent 15 million in installments this month. Jeez. Oh, what, what it's that? A, we're building the stadium up. Oh, you oh, were? Yeah, really? Yeah. yeah, we're getting a new stand. No. No. Hello? I'm in a healthy 13 mil. Schreiber 2 need a center midfielder by any chance. Oh, yeah, right, you don't play with that. Yeah. Uh, 
If you could play yeah. defensive center, defensive mid, I guess, maybe, but... Striker two, maybe. We'll, uh, yeah, take a look at this guy. I, I wouldn't loan him to you. I wouldn't have loaned him to you if, like, the only people making the offers weren't Peruvian second league teams. Like, he's literally so... He's literally really good. I just don't have space for him. Yeah, he'd be, he'd be great. I mean, I'm probably going to play him... Uh, Roaming playmaker? Yeah. Roaming playmaker, would. but that's good for training and good. stuff anyway, so... He's a good Roaming playmaker, yeah. Do you want him? Do you want him? Yeah, I'll definitely take him. Perfect. Love you. Do you need a wide field there, Blau? Um, I'm actually pretty good on the left and right wing. Actually, maybe right. the right wing, if you have somebody. Yeah, he's right footed. I'll I'll send you. Yeah. Is it is it Busk Mines? Where are you asking me? Yeah. It's uh Gerald Tavara Tavara. I looked at signing the guy you just signed, uh, Nikolai Busk. Uh-huh. He's really but good. I, I went against it, but I don't know if I was already he's very good. He's very slow, that's a problem, but he's also very young, so it's like who cares? He's gonna be faster. He can also play up top loud if you need him to. But I mean yeah. obviously it's the AI. Yeah, he looks great. I'll take him. Why not? <laughs> he's the uh, he's the guy that uh I bought from Oxide because I needed to launder money. Oh uh, yeah. No, he's a perfect <laughs> he's a perfect up rubber too, actually. Yeah. I, I think he didn't want him. I, I think I tried to give him to Fervor too, but he didn't want him at the time, so it happens sometimes. Mm -hmm. uh, Bro, I don't know if I don't... have anybody on the right which I actually care about playing. Because I think I got rid of the one guy who's kind of playing out there that I liked. Karim, a de defensive winger? Nice. For you. Good for you. Alright, well, you should... You should be getting an offer. Or I'm offering him out to you, so... Yeah, next mm -hmm. you'll I'll get it. Yeah. So we're waiting on me and Spicy. Oh, there we go. Wait, no. Oh, so it was just me. Got in my bed. Yeah, that was weird. Just said waiting on the top right for me. So I could have. Well, I was me. doing the contract. It was probably me. Harry, what do you need him for? Well, I did. Are you gonna play, Harry? Yeah, I'll play him. Oh, okay. He did okay. <sighs> I guess you were younger. Or Do people think your accent's weird? No matter where I go, when I'm in England, they think I'm Texan. <laughs> you know <laughs> that. Like, so I knew a British guy who had like his parents were from England, and he developed a Southern Florida accent. That was a weird, like, every time he spoke, he sounded so strange. You don't. You just sound mostly British. Like, I can't even hear the yeah. Texas in you. Yeah, you, you just I sound like a British dude with his nose just clogged up and stuff. Yeah. I don't know. It's it's a weird mixed accent, but I never feel at home anywhere with my voice. Because, like, when I was in England, people kept asking if I was an international traveler and stuff like that. What? Why? Yes. But they couldn't place it. So some thought it was, like, America. Some thought it was, like, Eastern Europe. Eastern because Europe. it's just off slightly. I actually knew a couple of people from Eastern Europe that had British accents because they learned the very British form of English in school. Exactly. Like, like their teacher will like be from the UK or something like that. Mm -hmm. and they'll like, just straight up have a British accent. My dad works with this Bulgarian guy who has a very strong Manchester accent. <laughs> <laughs> because he worked there for like 20 years. The question. What's up? Do you guys have any international players on duty, international duty players right now, or no? I do, yeah. I There's just some U23, like, yeah, South Americans. Player. I see. Yeah, yeah I've, uh, Yershin Chacon is on international duty, and so is Kerwin Vargas. Yeah, thank fucking God Korean Ronaldo is no longer 23, because <laughs> he's in some <laughs> fucking stupid tournament right now. <laughs> Playing the Invitational U23 Spanish Open. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fucking... <laughs> Definitely would be. He's yeah. always at those fucking things. Any chance he could get out, Freiburg, he takes. Harry. Yeah? Just tell me when you're willing to take that price. I, I can't buy him right now anyways because I can't change my wage budget, so... Why are you bid bidding for him? Because I want to, you to know that I'm interested in him. I don't know. Well, the price is that. 
Uh, that's the cheapest I'm gonna go. That's already stupid. Edberg's been called up by well, Sweden. Well, uh, I don't know. I don't know. They come back. Oh, I forgot I signed this guy. Wait. Oh, jeez. Are you actually actively selling Silas Katampa, Terry? Actively selling Silas I am, Katampa. yes. He is actively selling Silas Katampa. Damn. It looks like he's been getting out to a pretty good start this season, too. He yeah. is, but he wants to leave. Oh. Are you buying him? Are you buying him? I, I haven't sent in an offer, but I, honestly, I've been looking at him. I've been toying with him. I'll cancel the other teams I, off if you beat it. The, the thing is, I... I honestly, I just don't really have the money, really. How much money do you have in transfer budget? Uh, six million. Yeah, you don't have the money. Oh. Yeah. 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 I want money up yeah, front. I, I, no, I, yeah, no, I, I don't have the money up, uh, up front or in payroll. Like, I, I'd have to sell someone in order to do that. And right now, I don't have anything in the works. Get roasted. Is everybody training badly? Uh, just raining on Chase. Who's not even in the voice chat. Nice. So I guess he meant that he can't join the voice chat until 9. Guess guy was right. No, he's probably Oops. like, no, I got to play and delay everyone's and waste everyone's time. God he's me. probably playing football manager at like the dinner table underneath the yeah. table. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he's got an exam he's currently doing. Kind of a late dinner. Oh, I, mean, right I don't know where he's at, though, so maybe not. He's in Quebec. No, Toronto. He's in Toronto. He's in Brampton. Yeah, so like... He's from Standard Town, so yeah, it would be a late dinner. Yeah. It's not that late. I mean, I've seen people eat dinner a lot later than that. Shit. I used to do that. It threw me off on the, the dinner time. a lot of family, but yeah. When, sure. is, when was the dinner time? People were eating like 8.39. That's a very Spanish thing. Yeah. Although, generally more mine, European. mine would be early for Spain. It's, well, uh, true. Isn't the time zone in Spain very weird because it's the same time zone as, like, Germany? I think. So I they're, think they're level with the UK, aren't they? Portugal. Uh, they are, yeah. I yeah, it's, a, it's one hour off. I suppose that's probably why, they, why the British like to vacation down in Spain so often. That too, it's cheap time it's, zone. it's also very cheap. Yeah, yeah you guys all a lot of time on the timer, so uh, we're gonna have to have to wait it out. Who the fuck yeah, did so that? Spain is the, despite being more west, Spain oh, is actually minute, huh? an hour ahead of the UK. Yeah, that's not too bad. That is weird. Yeah, I mean, it's it's not as strange as China though. You know, China's weird. They got one time zone. Yeah, the Beijing time, everyone follows it. Big signing for Stuttgart. Oh. Hey, Luke De Jong. Oh, that oh, guy? God. Oh my god, another tall striker for you. Stop, Literally stop a with, big signing. Stop, <laughs> stop when you're, you're addicted. I'm not addicted, you're addicted. The tall strikers. Well, I need a backup striker, and he's just a backup of Luca. A lot worse, but a backup of Luca. I'm not addicted. How much did he get oh, at the end of contract? Alright, that's nice. He's, he's free. Yeah. I got him on yeah. like 600k a year, I think it is. <laughs> How old? So pretty, he's 33. Oh, something. He'll be there for he, this season. It's just to bridge the gap until my, my youth players get better. Well, you're a Brazilian finally joins. <laughs> D. D. <laughs> he's, I think it's still another year. He's good. <laughs> No, it's, yeah, it's next gen. Gotta graduate middle school first. He's like a defender, too. <laughs> yeah, I know. He's good, though. Yeah. I've seen him. Yeah, I, know, I, don't, know what, I don't know what I'm gonna do with him, though. He can That's play. I think he could be one of your box to boxes one day. You're gonna watch him with the youth team, and the save's gonna end. I know. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> he has to play the last ever game. 
Yeah, you have to play it. We'll see how we. I mean, we're gonna sim it into the future, right? Yeah, we we'll, yeah, we we'll we'll get back in. Yeah, oh. We should put a transfer embargo when we sim it into the future. No, uh, I don't think you can nah. do that. But we'll just all give our guys new contracts right before we sim. <laughs> so hopefully they stay around for a while. I mean, they'll bit. still get sold. They're not gonna sim. But for we'll like see where they go. Them for like mm -hmm. five, three. You I guys have me up all night here. simming. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just leave it on. Just leave it on. Yeah, how quickly leave it on, it your mind it off, and go to bed. Yeah. How how quickly does this sim? I'll get rid like, of how many leaves do we, do we have loaded? How many leaves? Well, it's a lot. Like of all of them. <laughs> PSG <laughs> wants Anthony Martial. Well, yeah, no, right. Why? <laughs> yeah. It's PSG. Hey. They have the money. Just shut up. It's just leave it on Inter and the money. Just shut up and let them spend the money. Yeah, but like, Leon definitely wants him for real. Yeah. Enter. Hey, uh, hey, Spice, I just want to give you a heads up. Yeah, uh, I saw it. Uh, I was just going to say, Kasim Adams really wants you, really wants to join Augsburg, so. Alright. Do you need a center back, Sky? Or, not Sky. Yes, Sky. What? Do like... I need a center back? No. Yeah. No. Okay. Where did I ask? I am all right. Yeah, I just saw you had interest on some guy, but it's probably old or something. He's got know. Chet near. He's probably just on my short list. Uh, for a loan, anyways. I may, I may think about. That. Do you ever just find the most useless players in your youth team somehow? Like, I have a twenty-five-year-old winger I've never seen before. Mm. Just chilling on the. Stuttgart 2 team. Well, you could look at your team and then. I don't look at my youth team. <laughs> I always I look at the youth team because sometimes there's players that should be there. That should, like when I first take over, that should absolutely be in the first team. Oh, man. Not often, but occasionally. But... Oh, wow. He wants a lot of money. <laughs> Does he really? Yeah, he wants 40k a week. What? Jesus Christ! How much is he on right now? I mean, he's on 1.4 million right now for me. I'll give him that, but I'm not gonna give him. That's in that's insane. I mean, yeah. If if, if you don't want like, yeah, I'm not, I'm only not reason 40k a week. That's completely back, right. Yeah. I, honestly, that's how much that, my uh, starting center backs are. Uh, honestly, I was gonna counter offer you uh, three point two million because that's what he was. That's what uh, BRA was offering for him. But the, the thing is, he, he said he'd become upset if I didn't accept your offer. They're like, "Fuck it, I guess I'll <laughs> accept the one point one million." I guess I don't have to worry about that now, though. <laughs> yeah, that's his problem for wanting that yeah. much. Greedy little shit. Except he's not even worth that. I'm hoping that that he can play better at a new team, but he's honestly, just not he good wouldn't enough. get a whole lot of playing time unless someone got injured. Yeah. Did he say it? He didn't say it, right? It's match day. He's muted. Oh, I said it was muted. Sorry. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's match day. Oh, sorry, I can't hear you over the sound of the mute. All right, uh, Blau, you want to go down to game day one? Sure. You're being real mean today, Sky. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry <laughs> later. <laughs> yes, your tears give me strength. <laughs> what you want a child to cry? <laughs> oh, I don't understand how. I don't know. I don't. I don't know what to say. <clears throat> Match sharpness is like, like a basic thing of the game. Really, it's literally the reason why you schedule friendlies is to get players' match sharpness up. You have their like fitness and like, you know, their ability to actually play the game, like from a health standpoint, and freshness, fatigue, stuff like that, right? And then you have match sharpness. And uh, it's really a basic principle of the game, which, uh, you know, 
you know, there's always, there's a lot of things in this game. It's not just like you pick it up immediately and, and know everything, but I mean, I don't know. Anyways, all right, we got to focus on Frankfurt. <clears throat> and too bad uh, Memes is not here. Uh, he said on the schedule he could play, but he's also in Australia and I don't, I don't know, not here, so. Um, our new guys definitely are missing a lot of a lot of time, so hopefully that improves. Especially because he's in last, so he may get fired here. All right, um, <clears throat> we are doing a little bit of tight marking, but we should just be able to dominate them in their zone. They do have isn't this guy? Got, no, they don't really have that much pace on the wings, so. Uh, we should we should dominate this game. Let's just get up, get some goals, get the dubs, make some subs, get some rest. Try and loan out Kyo George. I hate when you bring in a guy in and it's like, dude, it's like I need you for next year. I don't need you this year. You're not gonna get any game time. I need you to be playing like every week so you can. Like I just want to have that conversation. Like, dude, I need you to go out on loan. I don't care that you just joined the club. I need you to go out and loan. That's how this works, my dude. You're for the future. My goodness. What is this? We're on X10 and hopefully, hopefully get a lead here. Oh, good shot. Good shot. Oh, it's going to be a penalty, I think. And our boy's out there. Vega's out there, so hopefully it is, because Mans doesn't miss. going to check, but, I mean, it's too late at that point, because he's already out there. Come on, Mr. 20. Bang it in. Wow, Mr. 20. Even 20, 20 penalty taking. He'll get some saved every once in a while. Good overlap. Come on, Pellegrini. Do something good. Like, have a good game. He hasn't had one in a while. Oh, we're in. Hit it. Nice. Great start, great pass, great start. Yeah, let's just play in their zone. Let's get our goal differential up if we can. Good hit. Oh, I guess his left foot isn't very good. It's reasonable. <clears throat> Come on, Vega. Oh, I guess Vega's there, so. Oh, wow, it went through his legs. I mean, oh, Jesus, how? Place. <laughs> went through his legs, and then... <laughs> and then, uh... Despotov just kind of throws in crosses, like, but half the time there's nobody there. And then Makoko just gets a shot blocked from, like, a point-blank range. Like, come on, boys, let's get up. We're only up one. We've had some other chances. That's a nice save. up to attacking <clears throat> oh 
was looking at the uh, some of the stats earlier. Makoko is definitely one of the most offside. I think he actually is the most offsided player in the league so far, which comes back down to some of his rental mentals not fully being developed. Sounds odd, but you guys I think understand what I'm trying to say. Uh, hit Pellegrini. Oh, that works. Oh, jeez. Good ball. I think he's off, though. Nope. Not off. Nice hit. Nice hit, Pellegrini. I feel like the first... That's like the first goal I've actually seen him score since the first game uh, he played for the club. Mans just doesn't really score much. I mean, he's on fullback on attack, but... Yeah, that's roped. ball nice let's go this is how you start the half this is how you do it I think we can go up to key now and we'll get some subs out there Good ball. Oh, Suchich. Guy's coming on, man. Maybe I don't want to sell him. I would really like sell him just to try and raise funds. Really, that's the goal. I mean, I think he's a good player. He's definitely been in good form lately, too. Oh, I thought that was going to go in. Oh, that's exactly what we wanted. Nice little 4 nothing, easy coast, coast to a victory here. No pressure. Got him. That's a that's a really well whipped ball in there and a superior finish there. Who did this ball? Thielman or Dardai? No, nah, Thielman. Nice ball. Oh, he just ropes that. Apparently I managed to use the term rope twice in one game. No, I thought we were going to get another one here. Or I thought he was going to steal that. Because Thielman is uh, pretty good at pressure on the ball. ball then take another one
Nice win. Nice win, boys. Nice win. 6 nothing win. Absolutely just dominated. I mean, fully deserved. Everything was, was there. Um, exactly what we were looking for. Exactly what we were looking for. Check on the games. I gotta clean my glasses off here a little bit. Ooh, Augsburg's getting actually roped. I use roped again. Apparently. Apparently that's my word of the night. Let's jump in and, and take a look at this Freiburg game here. This game is actually closed, man. We really need um we really need uh tubs to come back and pull something off here. Looks like uh somebody's got a pause here. Blau's got a pause. Uh, looks like the two one lead is 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 deserved from just looking at the stats. Jeez, man, the yellow cards in this game. Holy crap. Six yellows for uh Hoffenheim and five yellows for Freiburg. My goodness, look at Hoffenheim's middle five players. I mean Jeez, man. Uh, if there's not a yellow or not a red in this game, uh oh, maybe a little break here. Oh no! Oh, nice, Balogun. Oh, good save. Yeah, it looks like uh, Hoffenheim with a few changes here. Maybe a corner goal. Oof. Freiburg's keeper's on point. I, I really did want to buy that guy, but he kind of beat me to it, unfortunately. That's where I kind of need to make a make a sale or two, really get some funds in it this summer. Although, to be fair, I really can't tell you. There's a couple guys I have my eye on, but there's not anyone that's like, oh my God, I get this guy and he's going to be world-class in, you know, a year or something half a year Ooh, they're going a couple ticks up from what uh we usually play which is why things are a little bit faster i think they're on two ticks up uh oh is he gone oh no he's not on a yellow i just assume everyone was on a yellow but looks like frows or frows uh blouse oh he gone yeah i knew somebody was getting a red in this game when you have that many guys out that are just on on yellows, like even if you have stay on feet, like I mean, you just got to get them out because, or at least a couple of them. When you have five guys on yellows, they're all in the middle of your defense, and that's where Blau's guys all go to. They all his inverted wing backs. He's got the three up front. I mean, unfortunately, Hoffenheim. Best he can hope for is a draw at this point, and that would be like on a set piece. Ah, uh, what we were hoping for. Like, but yeah, I mean, I would assume he went like stay on the feet along. Ah, uh, I think yeah, I think AZ's in Europe. Uh, maybe Paranvade. Paranvade's fine. They're not that good. I know, but the thing is, if they're in Europe the first season, I don't think we're doing it. We're Twins? just not starting there. What about Twens? Twens like basically that. Twens might be. I forget. All right, I don't know what they're talking about. So I thought maybe they were watching the game. They may be, but uh, ooh, maybe he gets a little steal here and something. Maybe a long ball. No, uh, maybe like a long ball goal or something. He just doesn't have a a all striker up there. I don't think Balogun is definitely not that. Maybe he can figure out something here. Work it up the field. Just needs one. Uh oh, that's not how you do it. Uh, this is gonna be Blau's highlight, unfortunately. I can already see the middle coming. Yep, here it is. Goal. Nope. That was dangerous. <sighs> I mean, at this point, I would just go like three strikers up front, or at least two up front. Uh oh. Oh, nice save. Offenheim's goalkeeper is is legit. Part of why his defense has been pretty good the last two years. Definitely last year, his defense is not quite as good this year, but.
Ooh, that's a good ball. Can he, can he, can he, they have two guys in the box. Not a whole lot, but something. Ooh, no. Uh, so hard to tell, like, from a tempo standpoint, how fast these guys are going with the speed. I'm just not used to it, unfortunately. Oh, I thought he was going to get another yellow. That's a good steal, though. See, that's what he's got to go for is a long ball. But he doesn't really have anyone. I mean, yes, Balogun with your superior pace. Oh, God. That was dangerous. Uh-oh. This hit right here. Oh! I just, like, that's the shit that, like, Blau's getting in the season. Just stuff like that from at least a couple games I've seen. I mean, at this point, you gotta go. You gotta go two, two or three strikers up front. I feel like play for set pieces or something. Just pump it up, pump it long. I mean, that's the only chance you got. This is, this is dangerous. Oh, nice. Oh, he's got the counter. This is exactly what he needs. Hit it, hit him. Oh, he had the guy open. He needed to hit it real quick, though. And we get something whipped in the box. Oh, that was his chance, I feel like. Three minutes in, two minutes to go. One minute. Oh, it's going to be game. This is in a game highlight. Well, wow, Blau uh, held on here. I actually, no. I held on here for the W. <laughs> that looks like fully deserved, though. Fully deserved. Man, we're really hoping for uh, at least a draw there. That would have been... That'd been nice. Or the more stuff you get in terms of money and reputation boost. I like that. So the highest pick can be like, oh, the best team that's available is like the oh, yeah. or the Rotterdam Prime or whatever. Dragon. And by the time you get to the bottom, you're compensating for it by getting money. You have Fortuna Sittle Sith Lords or whatever. Sittledorf. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't Vitesse lose 13? Who lost 13 nil? It wasn't them. Oh, it was VV Vedlo. It was, yeah. it's Vedlo. I actually, I would love to be VV Vedlo. I'm not sure they're still in there. <laughs> it seems like you just want to be in the Eredivisie. Just, oh, I love VV Vedlo. It's so dumb. Why is that their name? Yeah, they uh, lost, it was 14, no, right? On you, Oxide. Oxide, it's not very sportsmanship of you. Can't blame Chase this time. <laughs> that was a close one there. Uh, Hubs and Blau. Yeah. Yeah, two a lot closer than the last one. Blau went 2 1. When I saw uh, you had five yellows in your midfield and your back line, I just <laughs> knew that there was going to be a red at some point. Yeah. I, um, I mean, it was. I, honestly, it was a bit of a gamble, but I haven't had that issue in the past. So, like, that's the first red card of the season. Oh. <sighs> Bokum has reloaned in Arezzo. And it's unfortunate the, the red card was unfortunate <laughs> too because uh because uh that particular player has been playing really good uh, lately. A lot play a lot better than recently. Or a lot better than in the past. Hey, at least all the shit teams lost. Okay, fuck you. Like Bayern. True. Oh, sorry, I'm literally looking at the bottom of the table and the three teams below me. That's all that was directed okay. at. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> if that was unclear. And you, Tubbs. And you. And you. And, and off time. <laughs> oh, I've got a devil next. Three oh. wins, boys. But Bayern I, lost I, Tubbs, so you're I, right there. It still. is so hard for me to play devil every time. Uh, speaking I don't of think I've Bayern, ever beaten him. Not one. Really? No. Yeah. I've never beaten Hamburg, but I've always beaten Devil, so it might be a weird one. I feel like Devil's I've lost really good at to Hamburg. Devil, okay, Devil is a draws. terrible matchup for you, because the way he defends is retarded against your tactic. What do you mean? He, it is, all the lines are as high up as they can go. You can tell. <laughs> so speaking against of, uh, you, you are free on goal constantly. Speaking of but Bayern, I've got four I'm guys. Fast wingers. Yeah. Speaking of Bayern, I play mm -hmm. them next. Uh, and it's an away match for me, so. Oh, easy. Buy it a tiny, don't worry about Hunt. it. Just score more than them. Yeah. Okay. That's they're, actually how you win all the games. Their offense Wait, isn't. Wait, really? <laughs> <laughs> their, off their offense definitely isn't as good this year. It feels Thank God like you're back in chat, Harry. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad to hear that, man, because I. Both Norman's out for the. out because he's suspended with the red card, and so is uh, Wrestling Hope because of yellow card accumulation. 
So Sky, you're telling me if I stop them scoring as much, it's better for me. <laughs> now, you see, if you have more goals. Oh, okay. I need more strikers. Yeah, so you got yeah. it. It could Mid be midfield overrated. Nine, eight? Yeah. yeah, just score all the goals. That's yeah. That if is not scoring all the goals. You're uh, wrong. The good news is the the board gave me a C for that one two defeat. So waiting for Harry to pull out the five zero five something like that. <laughs> yeah. Midfield is over right Park the bus, lads. <laughs> That's implying I play five defenders. No hey, shot. More like a three zero eight. Two. You can no, play like put two inverted wingbacks at wing. Oh, he didn't want to join. Come on. Damn. You play I, hold on. I'll, I'll, I'll give him a little bit I more. Think. Give him feathers. Sauce. Feathers. So. It'd be awesome. Let's see. It'd be awesome. You give him a yeah, yeah, you give me like two minutes, maybe. Actually, yeah. you can play nine trick or Yeah, you can play nine trick or I just don't know why I give you too like, much. Or... No, I did. I just let you guys know why I'm taking a minute. And then it's a three that, two. That's completely right with me. That gives me a little bit of time to do three. something that myself. Work. That would work really well, Harry. Like. Holy crap, I can't. Alright. This dumbass Matt Hummels better be playing out there. I'm amazed Sosa wasn't a one-season wonder with his output. Like, every single season, he's top of key passes. I don't know. I don't know if it's just because I put him on set pieces, and God he just beats the most of them. Yeah, that will help. Especially if you have Luca and Sesco. Yeah. But he's just so solid. He only had four assists last year compared to 18 the year before. He had four, solid, four assists, but I don't blame it on him. The team was kind of rough last year. Because he's back to nine this year. Yeah. And his passing stats didn't drop. I think they just didn't finish his things well. Oh. Alright, Harry, I have the tactic for you. Oh my god. Oh, what is it? Yeah, what is it? The none of those six screens. Huh. Huh. What's the T? Nine trick artistas. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Don't get many ideas. Do? Do? That is the most of one type of position you can do. No, I can't do that because uh, one one defender's defend and one's ball playing, and that would. True. Me. True. I'm sorry. <laughs> you see, you see. Have you seen all my formations? It's always symmetrical. Only on positive, though. See, that, that's, <laughs> that's where the, the, the tactic falls apart. You know, I'm already on attacking. I'm still thinking about bumping it up. No, the Treks gotta possess. They have to possess the ball. They need to be on positive. Wait, let me read these instructions. Really high tempo, they need to dwell. Sometimes. <laughs> See, <laughs> Harry only goes to positive <laughs> like at the end of the game, like, and he's already winning. No, if I'm winning, I go up higher, more aggressive, because I feel like it closes it out better. Oh, okay. <laughs> that makes sense. I like it. I like it. I like how you put a thousand instructions and then put be more expressive. Yeah. yeah, oh, for sure. <laughs> Just vibes. The Stuttgart tactic. Well, did you guys know the higher tempo that you have, the more you score? Did you guys know that? That is true. I always have the highest tempo possible. And yeah, I score a lot of goals. Does. The lowest. what everyone does, like, very high tempo. Nope. Everyone sticks that tempo all the way up. In every situation, except in this stupid save. This is the first time I've played above low tempo in 6 FMs. Wait, actually? Oh, yeah, me. it's way better. I find it's, low tempo to be way better. It just doesn't it's work. It's so much more boring. No, it's not. <laughs> you just are smart with passing. That's, yeah, that's literally boring. It. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You'd rather God, play a volleyball game where it's just show. back and forth. I can get rid of exactly. I only bought him for the uh, sake of Who is Oxide talking to? Can... Himself. Just he's let him go. No. He's not even streaming. It sounds like he's on the other side of the room talking to someone I else. I know. I love how like we'll be talking about one thing and then he'll just like start random ram rambling about something. I love We're, that. I wouldn't want it to change. I think he has a cat. I think he just tells the cat. I got a cat. He's really fat. <laughs> I have a cat. She's quite skinny. She doesn't care about FM though. No, my cat doesn't either. But he's twenty five pounds. Oh my god. This could be like twenty five years old. I'm like holy shit. <laughs> No, he's like part main coon, so he's massive. Oh, okay. Well, that makes sense. All right, everybody, everybody, welcome Carl Toko Akambi to the Bundesliga.
Yeah. You got him at birth. He's here. He's just he's here to wreck. <laughs> Yay. That's a big signing for first. I know. He's yeah. He's he's, he's from he's uh, not... Lyon, right? Well, not now. He's on some other French team. I forget which one it is. He's inexpensive, and he's sort of always inexpensive. He's not that great, but <laughs> considering we're broken, yeah, he's on these right now. Ooh, he went in a player exchange, thanks to Spicy. Aww. Oh, that is actually a really good signing. He's nice. Yeah, he looks good. I'd, I'd, if I'd seen him, I would have gone for him. Oh, as a backup, he, yeah, he'd be good. I unfortunately need him to produce, so we'll see. <laughs> I don't know, but hopefully. It's tough when you look for a particular player in a position with a particular set of skills, and you get four, and they're all garbage. It's, it's... Yeah. Oh. Alaska. Do you guys ever use the, uh, when you go to scouting, it's a new thing I found. <laughs> Wait, where is it? Uh, oh, boy. What, do you go to transfers, right? And you go to director of football and suggest transfer targets? Oh yeah, you can, you can click a position and it just tells you players. Yep. Yep. That shit's wild. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's I actually usually that, pretty good. It is. Oh. Like I did it and it just gave me three good players. They're all Where on your teams. Go? Go? Oh, for real. Yeah. So if you go to like transfers, Ooh. yeah, the director yeah. of football, uh, transfers director of football, or general oh, yeah, manager, right. yeah, general manager, and right. suggest transfer targets, then click the position you want. Hilariously, he suggested three players, one of which I've got a two I haven't. But the two I haven't got a player like the play. Oh, Brenner the or whatever. Brenner I and Tarang. I scout. I was looking for a striker. Brenner and, and none Tarang of them are your teams. Team. Hot damn! You no, know, it's like actually really about useful. Ruiz. Oh, about root. It's like my bad. own spicy built into the game. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all the scouting done for you. Right? Oh my god, he's actually a bargain too. Oh, except for the yeah, Swedberg was randomly just on international. Nice. What do you guys rate the, the Scottish Premier League, like level of play? Because I've signed a few decent players out of there. I think they're like a they're not top bad. 10 league in Europe, I'd say. Yeah, yeah, top 10, yeah, something like they're that. They're one of those like, leagues that's a little bit hard to place because of how top heavy they are. Yeah. True. Yeah. They have two good teams. Celtics. Everybody Absolutely. else in real life, not not in terms of like FM and all that stuff. In real life, every other team is ass. Like yeah. awful. Yeah. Oh my god. My starting uh, center backs out four to six months. Doria? Ooh, which one? Doria? No, Papetti. Not Doria. Okay, good. Oh, Doria's sorry, I'm pretty sure your starting center back is Doria. I don't know. Not I don't Papetti. know what you're talking about. <laughs> I Oh then well, I've I got mean, another... to prove your points, guy, he will be. <laughs> oh, I've got another. I've got another Greg Rich deal. So you're saying next time I play you, regular starter on actual playing time. So next time I play you, it'll be fucking Dorian. Again, the only player I ever. <laughs> Swear to God, one day I'm just gonna show you my squad. <laughs> you ask Sky to name as many players from college. Just he can only name Doria. Doria. The only one. <laughs> Well, it's like, but Tori is always in the starting lineup. That's why he's a starter. I'm like, well, only when I play you, Sky. Oh. <laughs> when you're at first, let me clarify. I know, but you played him again. <laughs> I would believe so, you, but you played him against I've, Leverkus. <laughs> I've got some oh. potentially good Gregrit news. I've oh. got another offer for him. Uh, this time from a uh, from a team in the league that has money. Oh. What if oh. I bid for him? Will that fix it? I mean, if you're willing to offer me nine million, and you're willing to give him the contract you want, nine million. No, I don't. Nine million. Okay. Nine million. Yeah, nine is. Uh, can you do eight? Uh, I prefer nine, seeing as uh, come back. seeing the as comeback. Moscow's offering me nine million. How about eight and a half? Uh, how about nine million? You know what? If I gave you the seventeen to shut you up for a rezzo, I'm just kidding. I don't want him. <laughs> I think he's already. Beverage is very much a hairy player. There you go. I do not want to wrestle for 17 million. That's not worth it. Yeah, he's worth more than that. Not to <laughs> you, but overall, he's worth more than that. First, first, can. It's fair warning here. He's probably going to gonna want a lot of wages. That's fine. Do God give out stupid contracts now. It's kind of our thing. I really want this guy, but he's not a good signing. Oh. Should I ask? Oh, Zalewski. 
the, the, the funny thing is when when I got, got the offer robot, from who Moscow, I think is so good in real life, but he sucks when I got the, in this game. When I got the offer from Moscow, uh, it said that he was uh, that they were his preferred destination. <laughs> uh, <laughs> which so Moscow? Like, oh, I really want uh, CSK. Oh, wait. Did you say Dynamo? No, I said Moscow, and then I said CSK. Oh. Ah. It was like five. Well, there's only like three SK that are good. But... played there, so there you go. Seska? Yeah. I love. He's probably my favorite player. Who's Sesko? No, no, Honda. Honda. Sesko. Yeah, I yeah. love Kaisuke Honda. Yeah. He's, is he still coaching Cambodia, or is he? <laughs> I believe he is still coaching and playing. He's coaching he's still... yeah, Cambodia? Yeah. yeah. While, while he was a player, he was also coaching the Cambodian national team. Yep. Yeah. That's dope. I had him at 40 years old in the <laughs> Irish League, and he had 10 assists. Nice. Wow. Is he the one that used to play for Celtic? Okay. Yeah, I don't see how I'm gonna catch you now, Blau. You, you, you said oh, nine million, you shithead. Oh, I didn't say. I never said million. I, I said nine million. million. Said okay, nine million. I never said nine million. Oh, uh, fuck's sake! This is gonna piss Greg Rich off. <laughs> I don't think it will. Well, it, he already it, has so a bid accepted, right? My client may become unsettled if he's not allowed to play in the Lithuanian right? league now. We made a deal. I'm starting at Lithuania nice. safe next year. That's what I'm gonna do. I mean, I've managed in Lithuania before. How do you like um, it? How do you like it? This is the first year they're in there. Like an actual guy. Like, no, I like downloaded Bleak. Oh, oh, okay. Give me some tips, please. Um, wow. There's like one good team and everybody else is absolute terrible, terrible. Okay, and the good I'll, team I'll, is I'll... like not even that good. <laughs> Okay, I'll, I'll play as one of those teams. So it then. sounds like they're all bad then. <laughs> no, it's incredibly it's a easy. terrible league. <laughs> it was I fun though. Those Lithuania leagues are so glory. easy. I'm bringing Lithuania to glory next year. I don't know how long it's going to take, but I'm doing it. It's going to be incredibly boring. <sighs> yeah, true. What's the smallest league you guys have gotten to the biggest league in the world? So I did it with the, uh, the Danish <laughs> league. Bundesliga? I don't know. Like I I've haven't really Scotland so far. never done that. I'm I'm First. only worried about. Like, I don't know how you do that as one person. The whole league. Yeah, I, I, don't, just, I don't see just how that's winning. possible. I've managed lower leagues. You'd have to US, manage. So you'd have to play for like forty seasons at least. I did it in. I think it was fifteen or sixteen. It took me. Uh, I'm not I, uh, in Denmark. I'm not, I manage a club that no longer now. exists here in the U.S. Yeah, I think I got Greece to like sixth in the coefficient table. When I was managing Pauk for a long time, but that was like about it. I did some effort at doing Warrior that in Ireland, but mil? Jeez. the way I did it was I would move. Because doing it at one is sort of useless. But I mean, well, no, if you keep winning the Champions League, you keep getting more spots. We had like four Champions League spots in Denmark, so we had like they eight European stuck. spots. No, they, they, they all, all got good. Northland and Brunby no started winning stuff. No That's sort of a crapshoot. That usually doesn't happen. I think it's that too, like, wow, Brunby were the other green teams league. good? No, they were terrible in Europe. Yeah. I was just making a run to like the Champions League semi-final like every year to prop up our... Like that's cool, league. but that usually doesn't happen. I think Denmark also has a good youth rating. Well, I, I the thing is yeah, like Olympiakos would be like in the qualifiers and usually they would be able to do all right. So our coefficient wasn't like terrible, but... And then uh, there was one team that got a uh, tycoon. Um, I think it was like a Trotimos Athens, like the yeah, one yeah. star. They mm. they got a tycoon, and they were like a solid like like I don't know like Europa League level. Like, they Trotimus would just like the Europa League? League knockouts if they were ever down there, which is not that great. But they were like a solid team. Uh, I guess I just got lucky with my team then because. Would they the make teams, so like they'd make it out of the Midland that those guys would constantly. make the knockout stages of the Champions League? Yeah, I was Midland and Copenhagen would compete in the Champions League with me. Uh Bromby won the Europa League, I think, twice. Nordland would kind of like struggle in the Champions League, but you know, put him a fight. Oh my god, is it Chase? Now it's Devil. But oh, I, Devil. I won like three or four Devil, in a row. Let's Champions go. League. What's I think up, it was three. Devil, you managed that yeah, you were there for that. <laughs> Let's go, devil. Come. Up the devil. Yo, yo, let's go. 
I don't know why I'm so hyped. I'm just hyped for anything right now. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm assuming Slightly that you just smiling. mainline sugar. Me? Yeah. Two tubs. I didn't think it would work that well. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, so my bad. I didn't realize it was me. Sorry. Cubs? That's like the first time in the last three sessions I haven't. God damn it, Chase. In the one, so. Chase. <laughs> I slightly hate Hamburg. <laughs> <laughs> That was a close game. I feel like Fine. I had way more momentum in the first half, and you had way more momentum in the second half. So I'm gonna sign a player from League One. No. Oh. The British League One. Yep. Nice. League One. Oh, wow. oh my That's god! A good Burkhard, Burkhard actually went up to the eighth in the table with that one game. <laughs> That's amazing. Burkhard went to the. Yeah. Ooh, Bayern Munich make a flurry and verts offer. That's yeah, 30 mil. They're lowballing the fuck out of that. They'll probably take that. <laughs> that's, that's less than he's worth. Bayern are so scared no, of the amount of the like champions. They like, spend so much money. They're still lasting at 30 for me, so it's like not going to happen. So Mines, you got you got a raise all pissed off because he couldn't go to Mines. Oh, really? And then he's like, what about a different price? And so I, said, I clicked the button and he opened with 56 million. <laughs> I'm like, sure, if you can get 56 million, you can go, my friend. <laughs> I was looking to get like 25 from you. 56 million, oh my god. Arezzo can honestly be worth that, though, in, in multiple saves. Yeah, not in yeah. save, though. I think in last year's FF, I'm not sure about in this one. Yeah. Uh, at least or the after the, in the first update. patch in the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I, yeah I forgot that wasn't last year's FM. <laughs> I signed him at Basel and sold him to Leeds for like 60, and that's what built my team. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Nice to know. I said that carrot. Just kidding. I love you. I love you, Harry. I don't know if I say this enough. Oh, they still want me to play attacking soccer. I hate that. <laughs> oh. Like, bro, we I suck. Like, we're not playing attacking soccer. <laughs> They've been disappointed the whole save. <laughs> like, hey, I'm Devil, trying, guys. You know. I would love want you to, to play. play. Uh, let's see. They uh, want me to play just attacking. My my board is a bit disappointed because I have been signing uh, German players. Oh, yeah, you have don't that worry, too. That's optional. <laughs> I mean, it's it's preferred, but yeah. Mine's like desired, but it's it's all right. You uh, don't need it. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm not worrying about it. Jesus. The, the, the only ones I'm worried about is uh, work within the payroll budget, uh, the Bundesliga, and uh, play attacking high tempo oh, soccer. Let's, let's see. Let's see what I was. I ignore the conditions. Just do my thing. High tempo so easy to get. <laughs> In Brazil, be, like I where need... my team didn't have one. Uh. And, like you get promoted so they sort of give you the visions that you're already doing i don't know if you've ever noticed that but like they were like we really want to play defensive and i was like yes finally no one has ever given me that <laughs> before like ever and you i'm like i got you switch. who has the nobody has defensive does anyone have play defensive soccer? play what? defensive soccer. there's not many teams in the game and that have that those. Based on what he just sent. Oh, he. <laughs> I mean, it's like favored, so it doesn't matter. Oh yeah, we should we should switch. <laughs> he wants to play attacking. Oh. Direct, direct is awful. Yeah, that's that's so much worse. Town, get out of town. Okay. They want to play Brexit ball. What the fuck is that? <laughs> what? His his. Visions are defensive, direct, counterattacking. Apparently, of the I Germans. I had a lot of fun playing Brexit Ball. <laughs> well, at least, at least, I only favorite and not required. It's so dumb. I love Brexit Ball. I think it's funny. <laughs> it is funny. I think it's idiotic in real life too. Oh yeah, but like in game, <laughs> forcing yourself. Although to it does work that. better, it works better in real life than it, like mm. Stoke. That shit was nasty. You have Peter Crouch and. Oh yeah. Who was the other guy? <laughs> did uh, they have Defoe? They didn't have Defoe. They had Defoe good. for a while. Oh, what boy? It, oh yeah, they, it, it was, was Defoe. I think they saw they had Darren Bent as well. 
Yeah, God, Darren Ben on like FIFA. Like, oh, Darren. Was like Darren a, Ben was, was a like, bit of a beast. He was like in '86, and I'm like, I, I the thing is, I, I don't think I ever saw Darren Ben play live, because I did. It was hard to watch back then. Yeah, like the Premier League. It was easy to watch internationally. One of the first games I ever saw was the fucking Aguero title winner game. That shit oh, the was match nuts. Fix one. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Watch the game. Watch the game. It is so shady. That sounds like there's a United fan that lost the title there. Oh my god. Watch the game, though. Like, they concede, and then they just kick the... Like, off kickoff, they pass the ball to City. And they score directly from it. That shit happened this year. I know, it's shady every time it happens. Whatever. I'm not saying it's match fix, I'm just saying they, they fucking threw it. They probably did, that team was shit. <laughs> did they go down? Yeah, uh, no they didn't. That, on the last day, they didn't have to win to go down, to stay up. Mm. And some people think that they found that out and then match fixed but that was qpr right yeah, yeah. oh man i think they were like, down a from. man too i think they were only playing with 10 men uh, i do not remember i don't remember Have we started our prediction thing for the Prem yet? Oh, no. shit. I forgot about that. No. Waiting on spicy. <laughs> oh, it's a Champions League toss. I, I was just thinking, I have no idea who, who well, I, I would mean, put. Still where. a lot could change in the next <laughs> week or two. I think going down is pretty easy. I think it'll be Fulham. Um... Oh, God. I had it. <laughs> Not that easy. No, it is. I just forgot the name of the teams. I think Southampton's going. Uh, maybe not. They should. I think oh. Forum stay Forest is staying up. The other two promoted teams are going down. Uh, B Bournemouth and uh, Bournemouth and Fulham. I think are going to go down. Yeah, Bournemouth's probably not going to be able to survive. I mean, they've done it before, but and not. I think Brentford's going down as well. That's fair. I don't think Brentford. Well, well, I think they'll suffer pretty bad from second season. Second season. Probably. They haven't lost anybody though. Well, they lost Ericsson, but that's not. They didn't really have Ericsson. Yeah, but Ericsson was like, he would. He made he a difference very good. for them. He, very, he made a he did, big but difference. But they were not. They were not going down without Ericsson. It was close without him. They were fine. They were gonna finish like 14th without him. They have that whole kid. It's fine. Devil, you just gotta activate your three levers. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, it's, it's gonna start alone, but like it's gonna cost you a cartel. Just start. Every, yeah. Every time I think about Barcelona, I just think about like in this game how like it doesn't let you buy players until you have money. So you have to sell players first and then buy yeah. them. But Barcelona just sell apparently, fifty percent of your TV rights. Yeah, two hundred well, million. I mean, yeah. I mean, that's. <laughs> and there's still. Can you imagine uh, like money? how many how, how many people and would be in serious debt money. if they play this game? I think no. I think Barcelona is playing with the, uh, the editor on. Editor. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you must hate Barca right now because you're a Chelsea fan, right? Yeah, no, I've always hated Barca. I just hate him a little bit more now. Oh, nice. Enjoy. Oh, nice. Yeah, nine golems oh. flew in German. Oh, Gerard Tavera, go have fun in that. Yeah. Wait, oh, did okay. that happen too? We love you, Gerard. I don't really care about Rafinha. I think he was expensive. I don't think Rafinha's right. Mil. I think he's fine. But I like, I'd really, I really wanted Kunde though. That hurt. Not gonna lie. Did that happen? Hey, Kunde now? It's not it's confirmed not official, yet, but it's but like, <laughs> looks Barca? like it's gonna happen. Chelsea pulled, Chelsea pulled, Chelsea pulled out, and oh. then Barca bid for like twenty million euros under what Chelsea had bid. <laughs> There's like add-ons, right now. but yeah. I think Chelsea's oh, gonna have a rough season because Sterling's a good signing, so is Koulibaly. But yeah. I, I it just feel like it's gonna be a rough season. Be rough too. I'm surprised we, there's yeah, so we, much lure to Barcelona. I know they're like obviously like the history and whatnot, but and a great club. But I mean, I mean when they have like they're not even paying one of their players. Like 
Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Did They're like, hey, you thing? need to get a lower salary or leave. It's like, why would you want to go to a club that treats their players like that? That Rutgers, They're the ones they gave yeah, the contract to. that they asked Frankie De Jong to half his wages? Right, exactly. Wait, they Wait, they're trying that? to force him out. Wait, I mean, didn't he reject Man U? We uh, don't there was know. never like official he bid wants, for it. He wants his money, that's why he's not leaving. Yeah. It, the, well, he didn't want to go, apparently. But I don't think he yeah. actually ever he rejected it. He's, he's owed $17 million, so... What did so I think he wants to leave. He wants oh, to get that money. He's got a cold now. He was just uh, coming back for the fucking Byron game. Do you want someone who's less injury prone by any chance? It's it's not injuries. It's, he's just constantly getting <laughs> sick. So just play Dale Fry. Less. Like, I have you a guy that's... Flu to, be, to having I have a, cold. a center back. Like, I have a center sake. back for all of you. I have a center back for all of you. I have a guy that's... We just share him. A little bit of time. You guys can have a Malik TL if you guys want. For free? Uh, no. But... I'll take him for free. Uh, you know what? I'd take him for free as well. But you gotta pay his wages, Sky. <laughs> what? What? Uh, yeah. What? Yeah, Sky. I, I don't know how to... Oh, and then I load him to you? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm about to just cancel the, the deals that we've been tossing back and forth, Harry. What? Oh my like, god, I'm being more than fair. More than fair? You're lowballing me like a motherfucker! He's got a transfer value of nine million. I'm able to come down to seven and a half million. You're off me fucking five hundred fucking grand. Uh, and the fifty percent sell on. And you know damn well that's not going to equate to anywhere close to nine million. Don't negotiate with Harry. It's yeah, just bad. say no and move on. You don't go there. <laughs> yeah, it's Harry. It's Harry. You'll never get a good deal. He keeps You'll never countering. get anything other than highway robbery. It's. I made a good deal with someone, didn't I? <laughs> Let me have a look. So good, you can't remember. For Sisto. Um, yeah, Sisto was a great deal. Sisto was actually fair. It's just that he's a <laughs> fucking donkey. Oh my god, Steve has six goals in 11 games. <laughs> For AC Milan. Yeah, I, I love the Scottish close. kid I have, Frode Bell. No, That's like, my boy against so far. 16, 16, but like still. Freiburg 2 Academy project, uh, product. Oh my god, Stipe. Bamberg's got a big stadium, like, Devil. You'll get that money back eventually. Yeah, Hamburg is actually a big club. Yeah, I could loan you money, to stay Hamburg, up. but it's gonna cost you on the back end. Oh. They'll tell them. They'll tell them. It doesn't matter what your money is. All that matters really is how much they'll give you. I really oh, need to win game. this game. Oh, cool. Though. The Russian Premier League transfer window is opened. The CSK Moscow deal should be progressing faster. Nice. Yeah. That'd be it funny is... if FM23 had a button where you could sell your TV rights. <laughs> 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 you're like Eastly. And you're like, Eastly will sell 50% yeah. of its TV rights for 12 pounds. <laughs> Yeah, they actually do it in the non-league. <laughs> For 25 years, they get promoted to the prep. <laughs> Worth it. I was able to buy Joe Joe, the four <laughs> Joe the, Joe, the, the four current potential midfielder. Joe the Joe McJoe. No, yeah, the plumber down the street. Yeah. <laughs> He's a club legend. Keeps Massive. playing the Premier League. Yeah, but he's, aye, he's six four. <laughs> Built like a brick shit house. <laughs> what a header of the or ball! Yeah, you had one of those players that you got in like absolute non-league and then played him in the prem. Because yeah. I had one. I had a player I got in the bottom league in the game. I like this, Federal National North, and he played in every single league for me. I tend they... to. I haven't done it a while in England, but I would. I would churn my whole squad over, I guess, every other year. Nobody I'm survives. Most Lofa, but the ones who, like, keep scoring. Just running, yeah. you devil. But this guy scored, like, 12 in the championship. So I kept him. He scored. He had, like, a five-goal season in the Prem. Absolute club legend. 
It's like Ishmael or something. I had a. Uh, there were the one, same amount. <laughs> one save this game, with uh, Boston United or whatever. And I had a goalkeeper come up through my youth academy who was like prodigy. And I think I he was like a league one level goalkeeper, but I, I had him as like my backup all the way through <laughs> the save. Fun. It's nice when you keep a player that long. Yeah. Because the thing is, the backups don't really need to play. And no. Like, and yeah, the backup goalkeepers are. And he would always play like the chilling. for me, which was fun. Beautiful. So he'd get like a decent amount of game time. Did you ever get an offer for him? No, because he just <laughs> wasn't good. <laughs> I mean, he was good at the time. Like, he started, like, I don't know. The thing know, is, like, this is the first game of FM we've ever needed to have a backup goalkeeper. Yeah, I know. I currently don't have one again. What happened to him? I, oh, I he canceled the loan. Canceled his doo -doo. Yeah. He could trade up. You could get Zach Steffen. Is that an up? It is, but it is a lot more expensive. I think Zach Steffen's kind of big doo-doo pants. I know, but in the game, he's good. Is he? I've never used him in the game. Steffen? He's fine, yeah. He's City's backup. The thing is, like, they always play super safe with those players. Like, if you get the third strings on any of those teams, those dudes are nasty. The ones who literally or, never play. Or you could just find the, the Turkish keepers. Yeah, I could do that. A shit keeper, yeah. He's speaking yeah, from a you. very uh, biased uh, personal experience, so... A Turkish keeper killed my father. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm here for revenge! So when you get asked where your parents in DMV, oh. do you just break out in tears? <laughs> yeah. I'll tell you there was a Turkish keeper! <laughs> God damn you, I'll tell by in tear! Oh my god. Other people in Texas are like, I understand completely. Damn Turks. <laughs> Carl Toko and Kambi. It did my old man. <laughs> it's this those European Manuel footballers. Guy. Ladies what the... and gentlemen, it's Who's match this day. Guy on your team? He's a monster. The Austrian right back? Yep. Yeah, he's a oh, fucking he beast. I wanted him so you. bad. Oh, that's really annoying. Sorry, I have a bid for some reason. Oh. Uh, okay, we're good. Sorry, we're good. Okay. okay. Devil, are you going right to speak off. today? Do you want to move voice channels or do you want to stay here? I don't think he ever moves for games. Yeah. We did it once. It was during that phase where he spoke. <laughs> Before he left. Yeah. Tim Walter! The first time. For head coach. I miss his speaking days. I miss that accent. Polish time key. Is he going to Savage one for 165 million? <laughs> Yeah, yep. you could trade uh, <laughs> the play trade Harry Paul Winning midfielder. Double talking, I'd do that deal in a heartbeat. My God, he's crazy. Do you know if it's on support or attack? I mean, or defend, or like no? Uh, probably support. I I can't imagine they play with defend. Yeah. The thing is, like, you look at his polygon. There is one little tick that is way lower than the others, and it's defending. Yeah, yeah. there is. He has eight marking and twelve tackling. Are you really looking for marking the ball winner, though? Are you? He's yeah. a great attacking midfielder. What the yeah, fuck else like... would he be doing? Yeah. What are you talking about? I don't know. Do you look for shot stopping in your keepers? No, nah, but it's like, man. he just goes and yoinks the ball, so that's like just tackling, you know? Devil got a good signing with Gutierrez. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, don't worry about the marking. Don't worry about the marking. I think the hamburger were both of us. Devil, you gotta do the Twitter graphics. I mean, it literally says it in there. It's because of playing time. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I, I, just, I don't read. Also, what are the badges you have? Why are they all shields? Oh. And uh, Martial to PSG, so that's fun. <laughs> Even better than you didn't know we had how to do it.
Oh, we don't need devil. He's afraid to play Stuart Gordon. Just a gloat. I when I was doing that Gut Gutierrez deal, I locked in like um emergency backup, yeah. but I couldn't. I wanted to change it because I knew that would probably like talk it over. Yeah, but I could. There's not a way to like change it once you lock it in. Even if you go back to like promises or whatever, like you just can't really? change it unless you. I guess cancel the well, why deal. Did, why did you lock it into the first place? I no one else had come in for him? Well, I didn't, well, yeah, A, yes. And I didn't really mean to. I mean, he really wasn't going to play for me for a while, but. Yeah. But I knew if I didn't, if I if I lied to him, I'd probably have a better chance at the deal. <laughs> yeah, that's how it that's Bro, how you're going to play every time. You're going to be a fun. fringe player, like really fringe. <laughs> so. <laughs> I think he could have got away with that just so fridge and he's like oh so i'm starting every game harry yes harry harry <laughs> insert oh, competitions no. yeah but he's got a lot of potential he just needs playing time devil yeah that's all he needs and then he'll he'll grow probably at least Maybe. Today. <laughs> probably oh uh, yes they're playing hummels against me bro no oh, ramazani run i'm my sorry you went out one sure I'm I'm trying to get fitness test results for Chris Richards. He'll be back All soon, right. guys. Nice. That's not that long. <clears throat> you were like, he's not going to come back this season. Nah, I'm All right, I was trying to work on maybe potentially loaning somebody in, but. Good. <sighs> Since my center back's out for the rest of the year, my best center back, and it's not Doria. <laughs> Much as Sky believes that that's my starting center back, um, it's not. Yeah, so I don't know. I don't think you were there when I was saying though. But I started uh, an Augsburg single player save, and I started unemployed, and then I put myself on the team once the coach got fired. Oh, nice. And then, yeah, and then um, I put a transfer embargo on me until after the winter window. So basically I'm stuck with the squad. Kind of like in real life, the squad would have been the same uh, until the end of the year. Oh, nice. Yeah, that sounds good. Um, Like, you mean for the whole year? Or just to like the winter window? So I wouldn't be able to bring anyone in in the winter window. But then I'll I'll be able to um, make sign-ins in the summer. Oh, I see. So I was trying to mimic real life, but I was joining midway through the season. So like I had Pepe come in during the winter window. He did start out at Augsburg for the season. So I'm like throwing off my game here. Just... Uh, you weren't expecting it. Was not ex well that, and then I also wasn't really prepping for the match because I was worried about what I'm going to do at center back. Oh, jeez, guys. Jesus. That's... Yeah. No, I think he's on. Well, that's quite the start. Well, then. That yeah. Must, that, that might be, like, one of the... Might be the quickest in the save that we've had. You have a center back taking free kicks? Yeah. <laughs> really? Dar dies no joke, man. <laughs> I, I I was interested in him. Yeah, to be fair, I really don't have like Almada's out, my attacking midfielder. Oh, there's yeah. an overload there. Yep. Ah. Oh. Why was nobody over there? Odd. Um. Yeah, my attacking midfielder's out for a while. He generally takes them. Mm. But.
I got one of those messages like, um, you know, X players really, uh, really improving, uh, because he's been playing at, you know, whatever it says, like the higher, higher level, he's really improving. Yeah. And he's about to get an Italian call up. And then he, and then my backup right back breaks his leg in practice. Have you ever had where like one of your players, like not a starter, like just injures one of your starters and you're just like, what the hell? <laughs> oh man, I thought it was going to go. I thought that was good. Oh, nice. let's go, Pepe. I mean, if you erase the first 15 seconds of the match, I like what I'm seeing, but... <laughs> Don't know what happened there in the first 15 seconds. I'm mad that Planhart decided to leave to Astana. He's been really good for me. Oops. He was like Harry's third choice left back. Of course, now he sucks. But You gotta love it when like the other team has a corner and then you decide to like give a shout or make a change and then the corner goes away, you don't see the highlight. Yeah. That went really fast. Hmm. Yeah, it did. Uh, I gotta have a come to Jesus moment with my team real quick. All right. Figure out what the f crap's going on here. Uh, I don't know how to stop you. <laughs> stop. Well, uh, we we haven't really done a whole lot though. I mean, it looks better right now, but ooh, let's go. Yeah, that's that's. Good. I I just said screw it with the narrow formation, at least against humans, because you would think that you would have superiority in the middle if you're playing like four midfielders like center midfielders but it just doesn't work for whatever reason I feel like my team is like in this like um just weird space like couple injuries couple guys out and yeah some south and american random ass tournament because if you drop any points it's basically freiburg oh yeah freiburg I, it's that's done <laughs> as soon as i uh lost my starting center back i feel like like, my squad's not deep enough. It's deep, but it's not, like... It's not... I don't know. Oh, God. Oof. There's that man. Ooh, what was that? There. 
Oh, I thought that oh, was wow. over. Oh, wow. What a header. I thought that was over for sure. What a header by... Was that Udukai? I think so. Yeah. Still could be a goal for you. Hit it. Yeah. Oh, Geary. I remember the first season he had an absolute banger against me. <laughs> Yeah, he, he can hit him. Um, okay. That's not what I had in mind, but... Oh! <laughs> oh, we no, need one of those. Weird. He's a center back by trade, but he's kind of more of like a midfielder almost. Like a defensive-minded midfielder. With the Dachi beats. Yeah, he's a mix between a center back and a defensive midfielder. Sorry, I'm making changes. No worries. Yeah, I don't, I don't have anyone to bring in. Hmm. Yeah, I actually had the money to beef up my squad a little bit. So rather than having like 20, 21 players, I have like 24, 25. Which is nice because I can fall, fill out a bench every every single game. That'd be a crime if he scores against me. <laughs> hey, yeah. <laughs> oh wow! What is this? Oh, I thought for sure that's being one of those where they mishandle it or something. Yeah, I thought so too. That's just like, a classic like it. rebound, stupid yeah. goal or something. Nice header. There we go. Oh, oh, wow. oh. Nice Fernandez. Come on, we need that. <laughs> Um, Jeez, making all these changes. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> Until you score. Play. Just gotta get something out of it. Oh! Okay, with almost had the hat trick. <laughs> Going the four triple two. <laughs> I don't know, dude. <laughs> this. I guess there's only like I don't know. I guess I'm missing the, probably my three. But. Uh, yeah, definitely. And then Makoko and has be, a six point two. That I mean. It, to be fair, I scored on two headers. Yeah. And it's not like I've been bossing the game. It could yeah. have easily gone the other way. Yeah, we're on the road. I mean, you're not going to win every game unless you're Freiburg. But, but expectation. Mm -hmm. Like, you have to be realistic at some point. Yeah. Freiburg was losing six minutes in, and then somehow he's came, he came back. I'm guessing he was. Like Leverkusen's beating mines. Mm -hmm. 
Come on, guys. Hold out. We get one highlight. That's all I asked for. Not for him. <laughs> oh, no. how did we get it? You have to shoot the big five people around you. Uh-oh. Oh, man. Yeah. That was the right ball. There was two guys there. Yeah, it was. You had, like, three runners there. I know. I'm like, oh, this is it. This is definitely it. I think Pepe's been surprising pretty good in the air, at least maybe just this game. Yeah, I know. Oh, oh heavy hat trick. Oh, my oh. God. Yeah. GG, though. I mean, that's man. against my best center back, so... Well, Wait, wait. Move. <laughs> not Doria. So you're saying Doria's not your best center yes. back? <laughs> so, he's getting beat. It's just not meant to be. At least he had to yell at the team. Well, that was definitely a tactical battle. I felt like there's a lot of uh, switches, especially the last like 20 minutes. Yeah. Yeah, because GG's, man. I know you've been struggling the last couple of games, I feel like, so big win. Yeah, I, I've definitely been struggling against uh, humans, but I think this tactic is definitely going to work better than my normal 4 triple 2 Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think it gives you a little bit more width. All right, man, I'll see you in All the All right, lobby. well, GG, yeah. GG. Oh. You're welcome, Blau. Yeah. What was it? Wait, did you win? Yeah. Pepe scored half. Oh. oh? Although, I wasn't playing against his best center back. It's spicy, it's spicy. Guess who won? <laughs> Guess who um, won? Harry? Yes? <laughs> what? What? Guess... Who won? <laughs> um, I slightly hate Hamburg. Yes. <laughs> I don't want to play your because you turned on your mic mm -hmm. for the first time in a while. Uh, she fell out of him. Congrats. I would have known that she didn't win. We lost. There was a definite <laughs> difference. XG will say you otherwise. Yeah, you got XG because my keeper gave you the ball inside the 16-yard box. It's six-yard box twice. It's not my fault. That's your free It's not my fault. No, we lost. We lost the game absolutely, but he did not win that game. Lost five. Our U19 lost five notes for your U19 carry. Yeah, because mine's good. What? <laughs> yeah, if only if only Harry's team played like this. The salt. How do we lose five? Oh. I'm not upset. I just need to sign someone really expensive so I can get my guilds away. Where, where did the salt come from? Salt all over the road. Okay, let's not go back to. I have to scroll to see your. I have to scroll to see your team so I don't talk. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Spice, I think they narrowed down an experiment. So. Really? Because there's four spaces between us. I can only just see mine. <laughs> yeah, Spicy. Yeah. I think my narrow diamond experiment is probably done. <laughs> it doesn't work against humans. Yeah. <laughs> I, haven't been been playing against, I haven't been playing against you this year. <laughs> oh, well. Maybe it's your role. Because, like, I, I don't know. I haven't played the Nero Diamond too much, but I, that's what I used to be fired with. Land called? Or did you not use it? Oh, no. I used my new formation. My new formation is for humans, because the narrow formation just, you know. Poor. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. I think the four three three probably just like perfectly counters one. No, like I'm I'm trying You're to. Boring. Use the what default four three three holding. Hmm? What's up? What are you trying to accomplish? Uh, I'm trying to make like I have an advanced playmaker. I'm trying to make him drop back and then like all all my set guys in the middle charge. But he's an advanced playmaker. He's going to yeah. stay advanced. 
No, uh, that never happens. He drops back. He drops like if you look at the average position, he actually drops back. Like, he starts the there. Thing. Yeah, yeah. So like when you first win the ball, he'll go deep, no. but he won't stay deep. That's not what advanced playmakers do. But they will at the start of an attack. They'll go no, like, like real when the, deep. When the center midfield, when the midfielders charge, don't. That's yeah, the, but that. you know, there's a great role called deep lying playmaker. No, that <laughs> not, <laughs> not really. I, I hate the deep lying playmaker so much. Like every time I put him at DM, like he's just garbage. Like he really? can't play like, defend at all. Yeah, like I've had no good experiences with a deep lying playmaker at DM. So I mean, I gotta say, I'm not gonna. You I, don't have to play him at DM. You can play him at CM. Yeah, that's true. It's true. They, they. I thought they were bad for a long time, but a couple of ago I started using it. I normally don't have any playmakers, <laughs> yeah. or anybody who has the specific playmaking role. Like in this, like in my Christmas tree, nobody has a playmaking role. Who's been a flop of the season so far? Which player? A fucking Tyler, Tyler Adams. Adams. I, I called it. I think it's, I don't know. Uh, Actually, Tyler Adams might be good for. I think it's my right back, the the guy that Blau voted for, Kevin Dykes or Deeks or. What's his rating? Uh, and it's not because it's ratings, because he injured my Papetti for six months. Well, but he doesn't <laughs> get it for that. But yeah, that sucks. Six point eight three. I just want to last show. I just want to definitely that? not do his real. How do you see the no, last show on my team in a team meeting? I don't understand that. Why is that not an option? You don't ever want to do that. I don't care. <laughs> it's stupid. I can't do that. I don't even have the option to do that. Wait, what, is, what does Oxide want to do? I want to last He wants to team. yell at his team at a team meeting. Yeah. You can just individually yell at them. You can't individually yell at them. You can yell at them each in person. And with you can put your arm around them and scream at their face. I think. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure you can. Do that. <laughs> That's funny. I'm gonna I'm gonna try. I'll find a player I hate. Just throw a waffle at. Can you throw <laughs> a waffle at an individual person? <laughs> That's good. <laughs> the the fact that the the Greg Rich deal hasn't gone through yet is kind of annoying. Uh, we're getting to the we're getting the freaking deadline day before. Guy, yeah, what do you think about Gustavo Hammer, the guy I just signed from Coventry City? What? What do I think? I, yeah, go to I Coventry. No one cares. I can't see anything about Coventry. You can show me. Just take a picture on your phone. <laughs> oh, I thought I was sniffing back again. Sorry. You can send him to me. I'll look at him, but I can't. I don't have any knowledge of Coventry. I'm sorry. Hey right, guys, do we want to try to make it to one more game? Yeah, yes. we'll do Schalke uh, next game. Yeah. Okay, we'll do Schalke. We'll do I've got Schalke. Schalke. We'll all so. play Schalke. <laughs> I just played Schalke. I would love to play Schalke again. Don't Schalke. sleep on Schalke. Schalke. I've, I lost their. All right, Drew with them zero zero. So don't sleep on them. I'm planning on it. I scored five goals in the first 15 minutes against Shaka. Do, do we have to play the next game against, against anyone else? Just I'm trying to, but my my computer won't let me open the search bar. Well, let's just no. get back in goddamn form. So it is this they... thing where it holds oh. up. It's Hammer, H A M A R. Go to Calvary. Oh, this doesn't work. Yeah. They have a rookie. Uh, I don't think I'll know anything about it. I didn't pretty scared Wait, is he before. still on? It's an end of contract. I just got him. Oh, there he is. He's Dutch and Brazilian. Can we tell him he might get fired again? Yeah. No, this guy came up with my scout report as my top target for my scouts. League One? Yeah, I don't know why the fuck they're looking at League One. I don't know that much about him, but he looks fine. He's 5'7". I don't love that. Should I just but. run the 3331? I can't do it. It's probably fine. It, the center mid is the one position that I don't really care. And wingers. Uh, height. <sighs> yeah, but anybody else. And I don't even love center mids if they're short. Especially not right backs. No, I fucking hate when, when wing backs are short. <laughs> I'll, I'll let you know. I'll, right let Blau know. I'll let everybody know. Shit. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, who was your right back that game? Was it Tyler, Tyler Adams? Adams. It was Tyler Adams. Who just kept getting burned over and over. Well, in his slight marginal defense, Musa Barrow is uh, real but, big. But he's six, he's Korea, six, Ronaldo, Korea Ronaldo, who is 5'8", <laughs> and has, like, what, 8 jumping reach? That dude beat him in the air and had a clear goal-scoring opportunity. <laughs> Lost to Korea and Ronaldo in the air. It's oh god. Hey man. That one was worse. The Musa Barrow one is annoying, but that like that size on the wing is he, he, like he's only six know, foot. I know, it's annoying. That's three inches uh, on Tyler Adams. Shit. Sebastian Bernal is gonna be out with a cold for another match. <laughs> I just got another cold. <laughs> no no no, it's a, it's the same one. It's just taking him long to get over it, apparently. No, it's funny if it's a different cold. <laughs> different cold. <laughs> you had COVID came back, it was too just chilly. Just got another COVID. <laughs> yeah, not again, Coach, sorry. Oh, sorry, Coach. Snake, it's man. another COVID. You, you know how it'd be. The, the, the biggest... It's the a different variant. Mistake, <laughs> the biggest mistake I made was selling a Supignon. That was good money, though. That was stupid. It was, but... Was he that good for you? Honestly... Considering that able I lost Richard Trevor for ninety percent of the season, yes. Was you, well, the thing is, you should have just. Did you Wait. not side a replacement? He didn't. I, 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 I didn't mainly because I because because uh, Kara played decently when I had to play him at at wing back on the left side, and Chris Richard was there, so I wasn't too worried. I Marco John. And, I mean, I don't know. You... Marco John was jo Marco John was had issues. Like, he was bad in defense, and his passing was garbage. <laughs> oh, boy. Hey, do you need a defender for Freiburg, too? Mm, it's like central defender? Yeah. Yeah, why not? Oh, my next All right, play. Just... The central defenders are probably the worst position on the team. My next. Uh, do you want me to oh. offer him to you or? Oh, hold up! Yeah, just offer him to me. Right. What in the fuck just happened? What? I don't know. I'm g I'm gonna lose Bornell. What? No. Uh, Who's close? Not not release calls, but Real Madrid going in on him. How much? Oh. Well, not, not enough for me to say yes, but the thing is, he's you're gonna get upset if you don't accept it. Yep. Oh boy. Let him get upset. Ah, damn it. The thing you is, don't he's got have a 40 to foot... sell him. He's you got a forty-four until... million dollar release clause. You have him till yeah. twenty twenty-seven. Oh, just no. Just say, just say no. Just say no. Tell him to meet the release clause. Tell yeah. Tell him you'll let him go if he meets the release clause. Don't sell him for that right now. Give me a moment. Yeah. Even if somebody gets upset, you. Last for a month or two. Uh, sometimes. <laughs> Is he a team leader? It, it, it doesn't matter. There's no reason. If they're lowballing you, I never let those teams lowball me. Fuck that. Yeah, they they, they immediately cancel it when I when I uh, uh counter them with the uh release clause. with the release clause. Yeah. I'm like, sure the company. Company. Right, guys, let's try to make it to the next game. Yeah. Uh, it's the end of the transfer window. I'm pretty though. much done. I know. I'm pretty much done. <laughs> Definite, maybe. If I'm pretty uh, much done, then you guys should Let's continue done. and then have conversations. You guys should be Why? Like done. That's what, what are you basing that on? Harry! Doing a contract. Chill. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, you, okay. you cannot say shit, Oxide. You yeah. are always last. <laughs> I am not always last. Okay? Like... What are we saying? It's either you or Chase or Spicy. What kind of? Spicy, yeah, it's Cyber, it's my bad. Whoa, oh, whoa, yeah, whoa, Cyber. Whoa, it's not. It's mostly Cyber. <laughs> oh, I see. That was, that was a good one, Tubbs. I agree. I agree. Tubbs, don't let them influence you. You don't have to be a bully. Well, it said you didn't make it off. What if I want to be a bully him from here? <laughs> well, that's me. James Gomez is returning to Freiburg too. I just, oh. he can't, he apparently can't play anywhere else. Like, nobody else wants to, he's not useful. <laughs> he was a mistake. I spent so much on him, too. Mm -hmm. 
he oh. was a mistake. So, did Turbo make Carrasco I, offer? That's interesting. Wow. Bribery, huh? The fact that mm. that Moscow hasn't accepted or hasn't worked through that offer with Gregory. It's Rich over 22, game. right? Mines, I have Wait. him on the short list, but. I don't think I'm going to go for him because I already have, like, a really good attacking mid. By the way, Tubbs, the, the Russian transfer window is open for, like, another yeah. month. Love you. Love you. Uh, uh, so, so if if he sells after our transfer window closes, does he still go to them in that situation? Yep. Yep. Oh, okay. But he can go it's out. Not in. Their transfer window is open. That's uh, how I relegated Aston Villa. It was hilarious. Because <laughs> I loaned in Emmy Martinez, and they had no other goalkeepers. I don't know how that situation happened. But wait, they got relegated. They did because they started a youth prospect oh, for yeah. like 18, that, right? 19 games. The second half of the Premier League season, he had a five point something. It was it was bad. Oh yeah. They're not supposed to do that because normally they're like they don't have you. So and so is not available for load. They don't have enough goalkeepers on their roster. Yeah, you say but don't somehow they had someone register. on their team that they didn't register. Oh my god. Like, they had a they had a first-team goalkeeper who they didn't register. Nice. Probably a great oh. player or whatever. No, it was, a, it was, a, it was an under-19 guy. But... Oh, okay. Mm. Yeah, I'm trying to do it. Maybe. Uh, he's cheap enough. I can take a gamble. Anyone trying to offload a keeper? Yeah. Is it cheap? Mine says many. <laughs> um. Oh. Uh. Yeah. You, you can take it. Oh, I, I sold one. So. You can. I just sold mine. Don't you still have six? I. You can take have, Tim Ryan for four mil euros. I have four right now on my team. You can take. Mm, I don't really want to pay for anyone. You can take. Yeah, no. Is he? F do I have to pay his wage? No. Pay his wage, but loan him for the. You rest don't of have year. to pay his wage. I'm not he's, asking you, Oxide, sorry. His he, wage, he's 15k per week, euros. I have 10 goalies. You, you don't want one of them? No. Wait, do you Nico need Mantle is 10k if you want to loan him instead. Do you need a goalie? A goalkeeper? <laughs> <laughs> you see, he's rethinking everything, Devil. <laughs> yeah. No, I just need a backup. I don't have one. I, yeah, yeah, I have a backup. He's a backup. Mantle's not bad. This guy I'm giving you is a backup. His only bad thing is that he's... I'll send you Mantle stats. He's on 10k a week. If you pay so... the wages, you can loan him. Uh, okay, send me your stats. Yeah, I don't want your I don't want your keeper. Stop offering it to me, Mines. Vincent That's Company managed 180 nice. days. That's he's definitely going to have to be a backup. I just... Yeah, I'll take this him. Season, bought, and I bought three okay goalkeepers with potential, and then Fernandez was available, so that's why I have. Yeah, I should have signed Alvaro. I'm really pissed I didn't I sign it. No. I should have just signed it for the value because I had the money. But I let Spicy. For an eighth goalkeeper? I feel like you don't need. No, I, I, I it was like before the season. Like Who, who needs to send their back? I need to get rid of a center back, but that's not me. I think everybody's business is kind of. I not need really sure win. what. I'm just trying to are, are, are you are you selling a, a win to me, Devil? <laughs> I appreciate it. Where's Bella, Bella Coach up now? He's still a Bokum. He's still a Bokum. He yeah. is still a Bokum. Yeah. My God. Next season, I can save him. <laughs> He might get company with uh, uh Kasim Adams. I said, to... by the way, Devil, I, I stole Mohamed Kamara from them, and he's so good. <laughs> Kamara, who was the guy? Ali Kamara. That's what you call him, endearingly. He signed him from Young Boys. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Shoot. That guy was awful. 
I know. Sorry, and, yeah, I misread um, that. How, I thought you were watching the new side of the board. One minute's trash, another minute's treasure. That's what they say. Yeah, I remember in my head it hit so I think it was when I got to Furt, because I was like gone for 10 games or whatever, he had not gotten a single start. And he has started every game that I've been at first because he's so much better than fucking Kanu. Who's fine, but man, Kanu is not good enough. You used to love that hey. man. Oh, he scored. Hey, I think he scored six goals in the first half of the first he's season. He did. He's a little crazy like that. But he gets beat in the air a little bit too much. He isn't super tall. No. He's wanted by Watford. The next Will Trusty Kong. All right, well, that's going to end tonight's session. Uh, only got through two games, didn't fin the, finish the window, which, to be fair, I'm not too sad about because at least at the start of tomorrow's session I'm going to be looking to just figure out what I want to do I mean I, ultimately we don't have any money so it would just be dependent on a sale from whether that's Pellegrini or that's Suchich the only two guys I would actually really consider selling um, and then we need them to act fast if we do sell. And I would be looking to probably bring in a center back uh, since we really could use a top tier center back. I just not seen anything that's really catching my eye here. I mean, maybe Tab Soba, but it looks like his wage demand's going to be pretty disgusting. Um, and then maybe Soyonchu. I'm not sure. So that's what we need to figure out tomorrow. Um, too bad that our our top center backs out for uh, the rest of the season, and then we have some nagging injuries. Some guys that are coming back from some weird international duty, like under twenty three international duty. So, and then of course we have Freiburg, and it looks like these guys are not coming back anytime soon. I thought maybe they would, but I don't think I actually cl click continue. I'm pretty sure I clicked the calendar. So anyways, I'll go ahead and end it here.